everyone welcome to my channel welcome to evening family choice tv so this video i am going to be making green steel green steel is made from buck pepper it's an african recipe it's normally called ayamashi in yoruba language and it's healthy i said i should bring it to you guys today so that you can learn and prepare it for yourself if you are seeing me for a very first time please subscribe to my youtube channel so that you can see more of it as i upload a new video and if you're watching my video you haven't subscribed what are you waiting for please subscribe to my youtube channel okay so, you know bob pepper the, especially the green one have so many health benefits that you can actually research from yourself okay we nigerians and we are fond of making uh, tomato stew. We use it to eat rice, but you can you can substitute it with green stew. When you try this green stew, you will stop making tomato stew. It is healthy and delicious. Let's go to the ingredients and start our cooking process. Now you know what green stew? Um, we I have my um bok pepper. And I have my meat, it's cow meat, shaki, I have my uh, fish here, yeah? I have my vegetable oil, I have my hot bonnet green, I have uh, onions, or seasoning, and salt. So these are my ingredients and any other ingredients that is not yet. You will see it through the process of this video as I add it. I'm going to be simplifying everything so that you can understand and make it for your family. Stay tuned, guys. These are my bulk pepper that I'm going to be using in making my green stew. So it's already washed. I'm going to be cleaning it by removing the, the seed. Okay. So I'm going to be removing the seed. seed. Remove the seed and the, the white stuff inside. Why am I removing the seed? Because if you blend it with the seed, the, the, the stew is, is going to come out Bitter. I remove the seed before I blend. Yeah. Okay, guys. After cleaning my bulk pepper, I'm going to keep it aside so that I can start um, boiling my meat. Okay. Boiling my meat first. Okay. This is my cow meat. I'm just going to risk it and one more time. Yeah. Already washed. After pouring my shaki and the beef to the pot, I'll just add onion to it. Yeah. Then I add one of my seasoning, non cube. Stay it together. Then add salt to it. A little bit of salt. Just Season your meat to your taste, okay? Then I add my fresh uh, rosemary to it. Oops. So I let the meat to steam at about five minutes. Place my fish in the oven so that my fish let it dry. Yeah. After like five minutes, so I'm just going to check on the meat. Uh, you can see it's actually uh, getting cooked already. So at this stage, um, uh, I'm going to add uh, just a little water to it. Little water, so that the the water can cook uh, the meat. Okay. So I'm going to leave it at about 15 minutes more so that my uh, meat can cook. 
this step guide i'm going to be blending my clean uh bulk pepper so i'm going to be blending this tv stuff so people like to smoke the bulk pepper first in the oven before they blend it i don't want to I don't want to use that method because I want to contain the nutrients. So I'm blending it fresh. Okay? A hot bullet with onion, using right onion. So I'm going to be blending. I blend this one first. Okay, guys, after blending my bulk pepper, it's going to look like this. Yeah? So I'm going to keep it aside in a minute. Going to be shaking on our meat, okay? So at this stage, I separated the meat from the stock, okay? Start frying my my meat after my pan is dry. I'll add my vegetable oil. Remember, I pour the the shaki and the beef together. So after cooking it, you can so separate it. I'm not going to be frying the shaki, so I just fry the meat. Allow the meat to, to dry. So after frying my meat uh, at this stage, guys, um, so I'm going to use the um, the oil, the vegetable oil that I use to fry my meat, I will just shave it to it in my pot. Just, and then I can add more vegetables oil to it. Wait, I will add my onion to it. So I'm just going to add local beans. This is local beans. Iru. Yeah, it is optional anyway. So if you like, I like the the taste and the aroma in it. So I normally fry it with the onions. So after that, guys, I'll just I'll add my my blended bell pepper. Okay, gently. To, to cook for a while for like 15 minutes before I can come back to it stay tuned guys we go so at this stage guys I'm going to check on my on my steam you can see the oil started coming up already so this means they still getting cooked so at this stage guys I'll just add my Shaki to it, so just add shaki to this. So, still going to leave it to get cooked. Just add a little bit of my stock. So, I'll just add my fry me to it now. Yeah, so I'll add my dry fish to it. Going to add my seasoning. You can see the oil is on the top, so I'm still going to leave it to get steam. Okay, I'll just add salt. So I allow the 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 meat to settle to cook it. This stage, guys. Going to stir my stew. You see, uh, it has already changed color. So I'll just add my boiled egg to it now. Yeah.
so I'm not going to cover it I'm just going to leave it to get stay more yeah you can see the the consistency of the steel so you keep on paying attention to it mm, nice tastes good mm. it's really delicious it's really delicious so at this stage I'm going to be turning my gas off oh nice um, so delicious thanks for watching guys I just turn my gas off mmm nice nice mmm nice 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 thank you for watching guys my green stew is prepared already so this is my green stew served with rice okay look at that thank you guys for watching i hope you catch the way i prepare my green stew try and make it for your family you're going to love it it's so nice it's so delicious wow when you try it for the very first time you will stop making tomato stew green stew will be your favorite thank you for watching if you are seeing me for the very first time please subscribe to my youtube channel i turn off your notification button so that you can see updates anytime i upload a new video for my previous subscriber thank you so much thanks for watching please like this video share and i will see you in my next video bye bye